Okay. Fucking uh, taking a lot of pain turns me on. What? What the fuck? So I like someone that to fix your face. <laughs> I like some people's breath literally smells like they spread their ass cheeks open, <laughs> or they've been eating everyone's ass. That's what it smells like. Oh, it's bad out of here. Do you, and, li do you like your butt eating? Yes. <laughs> right. I have two only things. So which one is for you The main one with all the kink stuff. I tried to start another, so brief interruption. I had a second only fan as a toilet page. Oh! Ew! Dude! What the fuck? What's going on guys? Welcome back to another episode of DMV After Dark. It's your boy, King JJ. And here with me I have my friend, goddess lola okay so she's gonna talk about her experiences and she's also gonna be playing the no chill car game the latest car game in the dmv as y'all know okay so before we start comment down some only fan creators that you want me to collab with on this channel okay you know y'all spammed goddess lola and i checked her out on twitter i was like oh what the fuck is this <laughs> I was like, okay, we got to get her on here. Oh my so, God. let's start. Are you ready? Mm -hmm. We'll get back to you. Make sure you like and subscribe. Next clip, start an interview. You guys asked me to uh, scout out their OnlyFans. But in this case, I think it's fair to say that Goddess Lola is valid. So maybe for the new ones, I can scout, but Goddess Lola, she's valid, she's official. We don't need to do A that. thousand percent. We don't need to do that. So- What do you mean by that though? What have they, what have they been trying to find they wanted, So basically, so at the end of the, uh, at the end of the video, the slogan is like, uh, if they're on the cam, then they're not a scam. <laughs> and then they're, they're like, uh, JJ, how do you know the nice man? Uh, the thing. So they wanted me to sit, like rate it on camera. But, you know, you recognize who this is? <laughs> Goddess Lola, man. I'm so dead. Goddess Lola. You better recognize. You best recognize. So if you get invited from this video, make sure you like and subscribe, okay? Her link, Below. Her link is in the description. Subscribe to her and subscribe to me. But subscribe to me first. You know what I'm saying? Subscribe to me first. Okay, so Hit that notifications button. Definitely, definitely. So, got us Lola. Mm -hmm. What are your turn ons and turn offs? So let's do turn ons first. So this is another complicated question for me because I'm a split person. So turn ons are split into personal and professional. Okay, so let's let's split it up. Let's do personal first. So personal turn ons. I like. I like things mixy. I like rough. I like soft. I like it to go back and forth. I like choking. Oh! I like to choke and I like being choked. Um, I like I like assertiveness. So I like being told what to do from someone I respect in that regard. Um, but I'm not good at listening. That doesn't mean I'm gonna listen. I like, I like that you're telling me, but that doesn't mean I'm going to listen, if you, right, if right, you right. get me. Um, so I get turned on by that exchange, and, uh... That just gets you hot? Yeah. Like someone telling you what to do, and you're not listening? Pretty much. Pretty much. <laughs> and then, uh, I'm a little bratty. And then, uh... I'd say anybody that wants to genuinely just start like gifting me shit, honestly, that's I love getting packages. It could be anything. I'm not even kidding. Like, like anything, anything? Not any, I mean, stuff that I want, but like I have a wish list. And if okay. I get anything, like if I just come home and see packages, I just get excited. I don't even care what's in it. Okay. I'm just so, like, like a, you mean like the Amazon wish list that people mm -hmm. have? Okay. Yeah. That's also in my link. Um, <laughs> Go to her link. Man. Yeah. There's all, all types of things there. Let him live. Oh, God. Oh! <laughs> what? 
Just let him be. Oh, murderer. I just killed a fly, y'all. Murderer. Okay, so what? So that is turn-ons. That's personal turn-ons. Professional turn-ons are like weird because I don't, like people ask me, do you get turned on from what you're doing? Yeah, I want to do that too. I have fun from what I'm doing. I don't always get turned on because that depends. I I only get turned on depending on the person. I have to know you to be turned on by you. I can't, can't get turned on by a stranger. It's right. not going to work. Um, yeah, so like if I know you and you're just really good at like sucking toes, right? Like you just know what to do. That might turn me on. Being obedient turns me on. Okay. Fucking uh, taking a lot of pain turns me on. What? What the fuck? So I like someone that to fix your face. <laughs> I like somebody that can take a lot of pain and is willing to take a lot of pain. And not a lot of people are like that. Some people might and actually get turned on when someone tells me like, "Oh, I don't know if I can, but I'll try." And then they can take way more than they said that they could. Okay. I'm like, oh, impressive. Um, okay. Hey, side note, guys. I heard that toe sucking is an art. It. You know, I don't. Is I don't know. Art. I don't do that shit. But. He does it, and it is. He's learning though. Yeah. But it I is an art. <laughs> All right. So turn off. Turn off. Personal. And then, and then, and then. All this is all encompassing. Turn offs is talking too much and talking about nonsense. Okay. Don't be an idiot. If you don't know what you're talking about, don't speak. Don't just. I don't like that either. Cause I like being right. So if you saying I'm wrong, I'm like I know I'm right. Yeah. Bad breath. For true, sure. True, true. You'd be surprised. Mm -hmm. Some people's breath literally smells like they spread their ass cheeks open. <laughs> <laughs> or they've been eating everyone's ass. That's what it smells like. Oh, it's bad out here. Do you, and, like, do you like your butt eating? Yes. <laughs> um, but it's also like that's one of those things that could be like it could tickle or it could feel like real slimy or weird or it could feel good. So it kind of depends on the person. Okay. Makes sense. Next question. So you answer those. Those are those are personal and professional. Pretty much. Okay. I might um, have more turnoffs, but the list could go forever, so we'll just start there. Okay, goddess Lola. That's me. Next question I got for you is, what are your plans after you're done being a female dog and with only Like, do you have a plan for anything after? Death. Death? So you you know this forever? Yeah. Like this this gonna be like your full time just. I am. Well, I have a full time job. Okay. But you're gonna you're gonna do this for life. For life. But correct. Okay. okay. There's a fetish for all stages of life. There is. It is. This is definitely one of those things where you can you can keep doing it. Absolutely. I keep plan to it. make it full time though, like you said. I plan to. Um, I had wanted to get my sex therapist license and uh, kind of merge the wor two worlds together so I could just be legit and start taxing y'all asses <laughs> for all types of shit. Cause hey, you better get it while you can. I went to, to uh, I went to a, a women's uh, dom retreat and it's a life coach that um, she hosts it and I, I respect her a lot. Okay, um, mm -hmm. I really like her. However. All I'm saying is, and shout good, to, good for her, but the tickets for two days of classes and like a little party was like 500 a person or something like that. Yeah. No matter what. And uh, that's because she's a life coach. She's certified, so she can do shit like that. She has merit right. to do that. And that's what I'm trying to get at. Okay. Have regular people, Charge them five hundred dollars for some shit they could Google online, basically. Not that I want to offer that. I'm gonna offer in depth shit, but the course I could have Googled online. Just saying. Okay. Next question I got for you: mm -hmm. Is your family supportive of your OnlyFans? Is Do they know? They know. They know. Okay. They know. <laughs> 
Um, they're not um, too supportive. They just want me to be careful. That's all that they've. All of my course, family have said is just make sure you're careful. And the ones that I thought might judge me actually turned around and just said, you know, like, we're here for you. If you need anything, just let us know. But we're not judging you. And my mom, she's just like, I don't understand. <laughs> I don't get it. I don't understand. Why do you have to do this? I don't like it. It's, it's usually the moms. Yeah. My sister, uh, my sister is very interesting. She's at first was like, and we're a very spiritual family. Mm -hmm. um, but she's like, this is. This is not right. This is demonic. You're evil. <laughs> You're like this. That. I'm like, I'm not. Like, people ask for this. And she's like, right. I don't know. It's fucking. But then she watched uh, Sex Explained on Netflix and it had a BDSM uh, series or something like that. And she was like, you know, she texted me one day, like, I just watched this and it gave me a better understanding of what you do and I respect you more for it. And I was like, cool. Nice. We're good now. <laughs> So, yeah. Alright. Round three of the no chill card game. Latest card game in the DMV. Y'all know this. Yeah, how can I get the card game? Oh. Would you rather get horny when you choose or make anyone you want horny? That's a good question. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna stick with what I do already, which is make anyone you want horny. Okay. I knew she was gonna say that. I knew it. I just knew it. Actually, that's a whole lot. So, interesting about this, because he told me I could rap on here. I struggled for a little bit with the get horny when you choose, right? Because mm -hmm. I, I went through a stage, I went through several stages of straight. Denying being bi curious, being bi curious, feeling like a lesbian, realizing I'm not a lesbian, feeling asexual, and then being bisexual. And it was really frustrating. And especially when I thought that I was asexual, I'm like, nothing is turning me on at all. I have no sex drive, I don't have any attractions to anybody, I'm just here that shit was frustrating because if you're not born that way you're like what the fuck is wrong with me but i had to understand that i personally am demisexual or whatever like i just need emotions behind it i need to know and feel somebody before i can even attach that type of feeling so i actually would have rather get horny when i choose but that could be dangerous too so I stick with the, the ladder. That was deep, y'all. Yeah. That was deep. I usually don't tell people that, so now everybody knows. <laughs> <laughs> well, now they know. <laughs> y'all the first. Y'all the first. Y'all y'all the first to know. But that you know, deep, he's gonna blow up. So that was deep. That was deep. Bring it. All right. Next question I got for you. Let me check the list. Can I check the list? Do you make a lot of money from OnlyFans? And how much is your subscription? My subscription is $25 and it is currently 40% off. And... So what is it usually? $25. I'm bad, I'm bad at oh, and it's 40% off now? Now. Okay. So it's 15 bucks. Right okay. Now. Um... Do I make a lot? What is what is a lot to you? Well, a lot to me is a lot. But what is what is a lot to you? Like, do you feel you make a lot? No. Okay. And what is? How much do you make? What's the most you made in a month? That's a better question. I'm not gonna tell you all that. Can you say how many zeros was behind? Was oh, it wasn't that many. It was like it wasn't over ten racks. Okay. It wasn't crazy. Okay. No, and actually, I don't like. I don't want my numbers on OnlyFans to be high because right. you have to pay. They OnlyFans takes a cut of your money, right? And then you pay taxes on your OnlyFans, right? So you end up losing. It the more you make, you're kind of losing out. Cause so I rather people just cash at me and do cash transactions. Mm -hmm. All true. that OnlyFans shit is cute, 
and it's nice to have some day some there's been two months that i literally didn't do shit and i just made my little that twelve hundred dollars or whatever just not doing a goddamn thing but that one takes work and two just i mean it's cool but it's not everything i i prefer cash is king over everything fuck all that only fan shit is cute but the money money nobody's taking it <laughs> 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 okay, okay, okay. So, how does OnlyFans affect your dating life? Mm, it doesn't. I start every, like, date. I don't start it, but I, I pretty much in the in introductory part of my dates or getting to know somebody with, I'm a dom, this is what I do. I don't want to do it to you, but this is what I do, you know? It's just out the way up front. I don't have time for I don't have time for any of that shit. So okay. and it's worked out. Guys, on the phone uh, yesterday she said she was in a situation ship or something. Yes. Kinda. And it broke my heart. <laughs> it broke my heart. I was like, dang. I'm actually one of those people that's rarely ever single and my sister hates it. But that's just who I am. Yeah. Broke my heart, guys. Cause I was thinking I was like you know, he thought he was we're gonna, gonna get some shit. No, 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 no! Don't be putting words in my mouth. It was. Don't be putting words in my mouth. It was. You know what I'm saying? God is Lola. You like, saying? Oh, I'm gonna get some kisses. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna get home. Go ahead, give me a bounce. Lit. <laughs> I'm gonna get some. Yeah, you know. Fun. You know what I'm saying? I was, I was thinking, get to taste the God is, a little bit. God is Lola. It's like, we're kind of like a match, right? Because taking me to the king, God, God is Lola, Queen Lola. So, spam Queen Lola in the comments. Spam that in the comments. Let her see it. I'm saying, let's see what she thinks. It's God is. <laughs> <laughs> God is Lola. Don't Queen nothing. God is Lola. And don't ever call me mistress. I do not like that you shit. You don't like that? I don't like mistress. Don't call me mistress. Call me ma'am. I like ma'am. Okay. Yes, ma'am. I like yes. That's eternal. So, yes, ma'am. Put a little in the comments. And call her mistress. Make her mad. Make her mad. You just block all oh. y'all. <laughs> <laughs> I have this Twitter quote, okay? So the Twitter quote says. I want your opinion on it. So just tell me what your opinion on the quote is. Mm. Okay? So it says, women use OnlyFans to monetize their skill of attracting simps. So what's your... For me, yeah. <laughs> what the fuck? Duh. That's the whole point. <laughs> she was like straight with it. Yeah, of course. No, like... No what that's literally the point like you're a weak bitch and you clearly need some help and some satisfaction in your life so yeah you're gonna have to pay because i mean what the fuck i'd rather be doing some other shit there's plenty of things i could do besides helping you with your fucking insufficiencies so you know she's going on that's 100 percent she's the going point. on y'all i'm just saying out see, how, see how see how mean she is see how mean she is? if you want that meanness i am face, not mean if you want that i'm the face sweetest face. goddess you'll ever encounter because everyone else is going to be just wanting to spend your money and me i'm going to want to actually perform okay so if, if and you want, want your money if you want to see that aggression in person make sure you hit that some what's it called submissive application application, submissive application. Check it out. Only if you have money though, because everyone, every now and then I get a couple that just say they don't want to pay, and I'm be so confused. I'd be like, so yeah. what, do you, what are you here for? What am I getting out of you? Right. I don't know you, right. and you're nobody. So what am I getting? But that's cool. Yeah, 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 yeah. Your OnlyFans on discount right now, forty percent off, right? I have two OnlyFans. So which one is proof and all? 
the main one with all the kink stuff. I tried to start another, so brief interruption. I had a second OnlyFans as a toilet page. Oh! Ew! Dude! What the fuck? I opened the door to shit that I literally, that I didn't want to deal with and I just had to shut that shit down. Plus, OnlyFans was trying to shut me down. They're like, you can't post this. You can't post. I'm like, it's a, it's a paywall and these niggas asking for it, but yeah, isn't there like a rule you can't post like they they was just like nah so i was like okay cool so then everyone's yelling at me in my dms where's the videos where is the shit <laughs> i'm like i can't post it you have to request it and i can send it to you but they don't no one reads anymore so i just shut the page down and now it's a nude page now it's like so now i'm trying to start mm. only fans for sex and nudes like the basic bitches yes <laughs> Sorry. So basic. I'm sorry. Not basic, but basic in a sex in a sexual way. That's so what I mean. In a vanilla way. So in. That's what I meant. And on that OnlyFans, you're going to be doing sexual things. Yes. Or would you be having sex? No, I'll have sex okay. for a very high price, and yeah. Price as in subscription. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Well, no. You subscribe and you mm -hmm. get news and previews and then you pay for the oh, you, oh, yeah, the video. All yeah. Right. Okay. I got you. I got you. Yeah. So, can we give my And followers... there's also... Go ahead. I don't know if I should say this. On, like, I'm trying to figure out if I'm going to get in trouble for saying it. Guys, you see how she interrupted me? See, I'm, it's... It's in my cores, shut her down, you know what I'm saying? You gotta, you gotta shut down the female doms, man. Make sure, you know, that I'm the, I'm the dom in this situation. But, you know, I'll let it slide, because, you know, respect. <laughs> that was cute. Um, yeah. What I was gonna say is that I've opened up opportunities for cuckolding, which I didn't have before, mm -hmm. for in-person cuckolding. So if you're interested in that, you want to kind of make OnlyFans come to life, fill out the sub app and know it's going to be expensive. Going to be expensive. Got to have that money. Can't be a broke bitch. Not at all. Got to have a job. You don't have to have a job. But yeah. You got to have the money. I don't really give a fuck how you got the money. As men, you better have a job if you're paying for Goddess Load. She's expensive. I don't want y'all out here going broke just to see me. Send me your, your stimulus. Your Go ahead, send it send all the government money that you got this year. Because it's not really yours. It's, it's not really mine. yours. So it's, yeah. no. But, here we go. Now, Goddess Load. Mm -hmm. Queen Load. Do you consider yourself... <laughs> She don't like what I call Disrespect. her that. She don't like that. Do you consider yourself an entrepreneur? Yes. Okay. So, on this channel, we have the entrepreneur test. Okay. Okay? So, entrepreneur test is basically entrepreneurs, they can sell anything. Some, some, some OnlyFans creators are OnlyFans creators, OnlyFans content creators. Some are entrepreneurs, and their platform is OnlyFans. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. So they can sell sex tapes, blah, 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 but, but some can sell anything. Mm -hmm. So we're going to do a test. Where's the card at? Sell me, or sell them, this card game right here. I'm not a salesman. You're an entrepreneur. Hey, look, look, at these, look at these nails, y'all. Show them the nails. Mm. Yeah. Once you want that scratch you know? mm -hmm. <laughs> Don't you want to play this game with me? So you can stare at my nails and fantasize about me scratching that for your balls. Here we have the no chill card game. We've been playing this game and um, the entire time I've been asked these crazy questions 
It's made me think really hard about who I am and what I like to do, right? I think this game is good for smart people who want to learn themselves and expand and grow and be successful. Because although this is like, it may come off as a game, I'm telling you, you learn a lot about yourself. I've learned a lot playing this game just in this interview. So, I would go out and get it because I'm going to get one myself. Y'all should definitely tap into this. That's it? Yeah, that's it. What y'all think, guys? What y'all think? Did she sell it to you? Fuck no. <laughs> I, I, think, I think that was good. It was good, but I ain't sell it. That was good. That was good. But I don't sell nothing, honestly, because like I said, I'm not sales now. I'm an entrepreneur. It's two different things. Yeah. Well, it's like a pitch. That pitch. Somebody, I'm going to hire somebody to pitch my shit. Why would you want to hire somebody? You can just do it yourself. Because all I got to do is stand there. You're going to stand there, then act. So who's, who's the creator? Oh, Me. okay. Guys the creator of what? Myself? Of anything, of the, your product. My product is me. I'm not a product. I'm saying. Me. That's what I'm saying. God, it's lost. It's two different things here. Your test is flawed. <laughs> A test is not flawed. It's flawed. <laughs> it's inaccurate. So, did she pass or fail the test? I think she passed. She did good on the pass. But, you know, whether it's a. All I had to do was pull my grade. titties out and stick them right here. They would have bought it immediately. <laughs> hey, you can do what you want. But. Let me know in the comments. Make sure you like and subscribe. Get the game. Get the game. <laughs> <laughs> Alright guys. I'm King JJ. I'm Goddess Lola. We just played the latest card game in DMV. And we just had the interview of the decade with Goddess Lola. Let them know the slogan. If King JJ don't have them on cam... They might be a scam. Period. Wow.